This is Ashok Leyland's Indian factory. In this factory, small trucks, large heavy-duty trucks, military trucks, buses, and regular cars are manufactured. <laughs> the production process starts with the design of all the components in the computer and then the molding of the main parts of the future truck. Ashok Leyland is an Indian multinational automotive manufacturer with its headquarters in Chennai, India. In this video, you will see the complete manufacturing process of several different trucks that you commonly see on Indian roads or drive yourself. Let me know in the comments section if you have ever driven these trucks. This part of the factory produces engines for trucks. As you can see, there are hundreds of them ready here. At the same time, as the engines are being assembled in one part of the factory, the chassis is being built in another part of the factory. The ladder chassis assembly starts with four operators attaching the cross members to the two longitudinal members. Each workstation is timed in order to achieve a goal of minimum production time. Chassis is from steel alloys and brackets made of aluminium. The pre-assembled axles are added to the chassis. The finished engine is then lifted and attached to the driveline and chassis to complete the vehicle frame. Here, the frame, the basis of the future truck, is assembled, the necessary brackets are installed, on which all subsequent components and parts of the vehicle will be attached. The main chassis frame and engine are then assembled at the same time. There are many checks involved in the construction of the chassis, and workers often focus on improving processes and procedures in the factory. The vehicle body is finished and inspected before entering the wedding process with the chassis. The vehicle engine assembly, including the transmission, are the most expensive parts of any truck. No defects are allowed to occur here and the highest possible level of cleanliness is maintained in this part of the factory. Factory workers wear yellow helmets as a mandatory dress code. It's for their own protection. As you can see, the engines are also tested in production before they are connected to the truck chassis. However, the checks are only random, and not every engine is checked this thoroughly. This is the parts warehouse inside the Ashok Leyland factory. You will find millions of parts here, carefully sorted. Now it undergoes functional verification of electric and electronic components and a check that the proper torque is set to the wheel nuts. Quality control is long and properly done. The workers move along the production line with the chassis while they add all the remaining components carefully. Every day more than 570 engines are produced under three different power and size classes, making it one of the most versatile engine manufacturing units in the country. Hoser One factory has an innovative pick to light system that automates and streamlines the process of identifying the correct path required to feed the assembly line. This matrix-based model has state-of-the-art software and hardware integration saving time in inventory management. Camshaft Miller is where camshaft is manufactured. This powerful engine is equipped with a special gearbox, which allows for more power and fuel savings due to its lighter weight. With a market share of 32%, it is the third largest manufacturer of buses in the world and the 10th largest manufacturer of trucks. With the corporate office located in Chennai, its manufacturing facilities are in Enore, Bandara, two in Hoser, Alwar, and Pantnagar. I am sorry for my mispronunciation of some of the names. 
Once the main parts are finished, the engine and chassis are joined together. This part of the manufacturing process is called marriage. It is a very important moment when everything has to fit together beautifully. Ashok Leyland also has overseas manufacturing units with a bus manufacturing facility in Ras Al Khaimah, one at Leeds, United Kingdom, and a joint venture with the All Teams Group for the manufacture of high press die casting extruded aluminium components for the automotive and telecommunications sectors. A large part of this Indian factory complex is also teaching, developing, and working behind the computer. Of course, a large part of these workers are also women. This company treats women really well and encourages the female section of Indian society not to hesitate to come and work in this particular factory. These shots again come from packaging stations, where a range of high quality packaging materials are used for subcomponents, which are then used in the manufacturing process. Now the engine is connected to the chassis and the electrical cables are connected, preparing for the truck cab and other important preparations before further assembly. The plant has diversified its capabilities by setting up a dedicated engine recon center, where it can take an old engine and transform it into a fully functional and roadworthy component. This reconditioning service has rapidly grown into a popular vertical that echoes Ashok Leyland's customer-centric approach to manufacturing approach. To keep pace with the rapid growth in the commercial vehicle sector, an engine development center is located within its premises. This facilitates an easy and immediate interface between the development and the manufacturing teams, resulting in quick responses to the evolving market requirements in engine technology. In special paint chambers, all individual parts of the truck are covered with several layers of paint. This is done almost entirely with the help of 16 expensive robot sprayers. Even the supply of various paints is automatic. The required amount of paint is transported to the robots through the original pipeline system. With high levels of automation in the plant, Hoser One Factory has invested in the electronic service lab with exceptionally trained personnel. This in-house servicing capability ensures the trouble-free functioning of the automated production lines and dramatically reduces production times. It is the plant that has an in-house warehousing facility where spares for all the plants are aggregated at one central point. The warehouse also serves as a distribution point for the online sales of Ashok Leyland's spare parts business. The engines manufactured in Hosur One factory power more than a million Ashok Leyland vehicles. Through its highly skilled human resources, robust manufacturing process, and comprehensive in-house facilities, Hosur One has the framework to stay nimble in a fast-evolving market for world-class engines. As you may have just seen, when the trucks are built and started up in the factory, there is a whole series of tests. The performance of the truck is tested, the capabilities of the engine, and of course, the electronics and controls such as the turn signals. If everything is in order, the truck is taken out on an outdoor testing circuit. During this test drive, an experienced member of staff checks all the driving characteristics. Only then is the entire car showered and can be transported to its future owner. The cars often wait for many weeks in the huge car park immediately outside the Ashok Leyland factory before being transported. 